I wrote Not Here, which is the first single off my Love Is Gonna Love album, um, during a time when I was having like really big relationship challenges. And, you know, I think we all kind of go through this at some point or another, but just being in a relationship and, and feeling so codependent, even though you don't really realize that's what it is, in retrospect, that's exactly what it was. It's, it's just the idea of someone saying, I love you, I care for you, I'll do this for you, I'll be there for you. But ultimately, like the proof is in the pudding. And, and there was a time at that time that I felt like, well, if you love me, you care. Where is that? Where is that proof? So the song really spawned out of an emotional guttural time of like feeling rejected and hurt and being a songwriter you know we're able to take one moment and and, and and make an entire world and story out of it so that's what I did with this song and it, mostly it's it's written in like past tense so that you know, there's even the line in um, at the end, the ad lib, I don't even miss you. Like all the stuff you want to say, if you're like, as soon as I break up with this person, you know, you're going to regret this. You suck. I'm doing so good without you. It's that classic story of, of feeling rejected and wanting to be a little spiteful. So um, admitting that I'm emotionally immature would be a good thing. <laughs> Hopefully I've grown since, that was some years ago. But, um, so yeah, I wrote it and I produced the demo with uh, a very tribal kind of sound. I put didgeridoos in the track immediately and it felt just, it felt right. Like, yeah, this is this, is this world sound, it's where I'm from. It felt really rootsy, um, according to what's rootsy in Australia. And, and it just evolved into this empowering anthem kind of thing of like, I'm doing so much better without you. Um, needless to say, I'm still with the guy. And I think this song is just a, <laughs> a past moment. So yeah. Okay.